This is what we have to do for the deep sleep for it to work right. Hi, Legacy. What's up, buddy? How am I doing today? I'm fantastic, my friend. We got the we got the startings of our creeper farm. We just gotta get cats moved in and stuff. Uh, Thunder, I was in Alaska. I was in Alaska, but I think I was doing the Michigan map when I stopped playing. I was trying to 100% Michigan before I went any further. How you doing, Pat? Welcome in, bud. Happy Wednesday. It is Wednesday, my dudes. Just getting burned out. I hope I'm well. I'm doing fantastic, Ben. My DMs are always open, man, if you just need to vent. You know you don't have to be as outgoing as you are. If that's what's burning you out, you can just chill. You're more than welcome to do that. Why cut deep slates? I can turn it into tiles and use it in my build. Well, I mean, they want it to be challenging, Thunder. I wouldn't say no apparent reason. I'm going to put tiles down here, too. That way it looks better. Or maybe copper. No, because it wouldn't match the, um... It wouldn't match the, uh... That stuff. I can't think of the name now. <laughs> See? I can do this with it. Number nine. So now I can make deep slate tiles. And I can use them to my advantage. Yeah, that goes with it a lot better. Just finished playing for three hours. Almost didn't do anything of another anything of importance. Yep, sounds about right. Sounds like you're getting the true experience. The true SnowRunner experience. That's where we hop out at. I'm gonna come down here and get this one. Then we can hop out. Uh oh. At least you have, you have, you have me as a shotgun driver. Are we there yet? <laughs> Are we there yet, Thunder? <laughs> <clears throat> Nether portals? What'd you miss? What do you mean, what'd you miss? What did you miss? Not sure what the portals are for. For moving creepers. This isn't just a drop kill hole. It is a drop kill hole. 
but we're building the actual spawners as close to zero as possible to get maximum efficiency out of our um, stuff. Is this OW bottom setup? What? Huh? Overworld. Yeah. Yeah, this is the overworld that we're working on right now. Oh, hey, guys, look, diamonds. Um, we need copper right here. Oh, no, wait. That's not what I wanted to do. Crap. I screwed up. Oops. Um. I'm just going to do this real quick for filler at the bottom. No, it needs to be tiles here. Uh, no one's gonna see this, so I can do this. Ta-da! They spawn at zero, get portaled, and dragged upwards. Up to there. So they're not gonna they're not gonna spawn at zero. They're gonna spawn at like just a they're they're spawning at like minus something. Not, I haven't determined that yet. Whatever's right above here, and they're gonna they're gonna be water down here that pushes them into these portals. They're gonna teleport. They're gonna teleport here to uh, Y95, there's gonna be a cat back there. It's gonna scare them up some stairs. They're gonna drop. There's gonna be a cat here that scares them into here. And then this takes them up to Y100, where there's gonna be cats that scare them into a hole and they fall to their death. And then we reap the benefits and move on from there. Quality materials. Qual only the qual best quality materials. So what we're doing right now is we're getting the water chamber set up because we're going to put the farm... The farm's going to sit right on top of this. Boom. So we're getting all the materials set up. That way we can just start getting everything going. So it should be fun. We'll see. We'll see how it all turns out. I think this chamber might be a little large, but I, I think this is fine. Four, five. So five out. So let's cut this. One, two, three, four, five. I like a whole plethora of things, chat. Invoker, I hope you're having a good day, bud. Thanks for coming in and hanging out. I should get some buckets of water and at least see if it'll look nice or run well. Yeah, I, I think it should. But the water's going to be behind where the creepers are going to fall down from. That way they have no recourse and they're forced into the portal. I 
I just gotta cobble some more deep sleep. But yeah, it's definitely definitely a work in progress. Why is the creeper spawning more efficient lower? I thought the sky would be better because nowhere else for things to spawn. Uh, the way the algorithm works. Minecraft has a spawning algorithm that they use. And there, there are detail, there are wiki posts and YouTube videos that go into depth about it. <clears throat> does water put a por put out a portal? It does. But, um, oh, we're probably going to have to put it closer to the edge of the water. That way it doesn't break the portal. So, yeah, I got to build these out a little more. Killed with a pickaxe. How do you feel about that? Yeah, we're going to have to go seven blocks out instead of five for the water to work well. And pushing them out. But for now, I got to cobble some deep sleep. Jaws Toe. That's why we went and spawn proofed everything around to keep something, to keep stuff from spawning. And that's why we're building in the ocean. Because it kind of gives us a lot of unspawnable spaces to begin with. We're taking advantage of the spawning algorithm. And that's why I'm making it fall back through itself. That way we can build as close to the bottom as possible. Why even run Optifine in your case? For stream. For you guys. The connected textures glass make things look better for you and the, the no fog allow you to see all my builds and stuff. Like, like for instance, this, this glass right here, if I go into the options for Optifine, and I go into, one second, where's it at? If I turn that off, can, can you see it? See how it looks? I wouldn't mind that myself, but for the sake of stream, you guys probably wouldn't be a big fan of that. Same thing for the glass, too. See how the glass looks now? Bye, Thunder. Have a good night. Yeah, Snook, we got an anonymous $1,000 tip overnight when I wasn't streaming, and I don't know who it's from. So I'm kind of cautiously optimistic about it. In fact, it could be connected textures that's making it run the way it's running. Yeah, the only message was enjoy your vacation. So it was somebody in the stream. I just don't know who it was. I kind of I kind of wish I knew who it was that way I could feel a little more secure about it, you know. But if they want to remain anonymous, they can remain anonymous. I mean, I don't I don't need it. But another reason why, number nine, I'll, I'll show you here in a minute. I'll, I'll show you another reason why I need Optifine. Just just so that you know, also. Worried about them refunding? Yeah. Can't you see the PayPal? I can see the, the email address and the name, yeah. But I don't know the names, Mr. Peril. I don't know your first and last name. How'd you clear out that area with my pickaxe? Did it take long? It sure did. That's why if I if I knew the username, Mr. Peril, I would feel better about it. <laughs> yeah, number nine. I'll show you here in just a second, bud. We have to cobble this deep sleep.
Yeah, Strider. I'll show you another area that we that we dug out with a pickaxe too here in just a minute because I'm showing um, number nine an advantage of Optifine for stream purposes. With Cobbler? <laughs> oh, nope. There it goes. It's messing up. So it's not going to detect you as it causes that to happen. Okay, so let me turn that back on then. Uh, here. We'll do we'll do fast and see how it looks. All right. So number nine, we're gonna go to the gold farm real quick. I'm gonna show you another another big huge advantage to using Optifine. I think I may have put the boat away. I did. Okay. Ouch. Please hold. Well, the disadvantage of Optify number nine is that, you know, it is a mod and certain people come out of the woodwork and be like, mm. You're not playing vanilla because it's modded and uh, you know, it's whatever But you see you see this number nine See how you can see all of that That's because we have fog Turned off you can't turn fog off in the base game. This is how it would look otherwise look at our gold farm Look at it isn't it cool? Look at what? Huh? The nether the nether's really bad for fog. Like you can't see anything. Yeah, number nine. It, it's not you won't be able to see any of the build if we just left the fog on. So so that's why I use Optifine so that you guys can see what we're building. Otherwise you're not gonna see it. It'll just look like this, and you'll never know all the hard work I put into it. Strider, are you still here, bud? I don't know if Strider's still here or not. If they had this option here to turn off in the base game, I you are still here? Check this out, dude. This was a 256 square area that we cleared out, put lava down and everything else in the nether. This isn't built on the roof. This is built in the nether. And there's all the piglins coming down. They're all dying and stuff. Chat, look at them go. Have I tried sodium? I don't want to do... I don't want to try sodium because sodium is like a mod platform. Who cares wins? Optifine isn't a mod platform. Yeah, Strider, it's 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 a lot of fun, dude. This is how I do things. But yeah, I, I made stairs and spawn proof them and put stair and put gold down and we got a hole in the nether and it's a functional gold farm. Oops. Ouch. Can we not die? I shouldn't be using rockets right now because we're almost out. We'll just run the rest of the way. Cause I'm gonna kill myself otherwise. <laughs> How's it going tonight? It's going pretty well. <clears throat> we got the portal system working for the farm. Now we're gonna get the uh, we're gonna get a couple layers built. To just kind of see how that works, and we got to get the water put down for the catch basin at the bottom. But all in all, it's going it's going all right. I gotta go to the top of those blocks and cut that stuff down. 
Can I reach it without using another rocket? Nope, I gotta use another rocket. Chai tea is what you needed, rock on. Cool. All right, let's go. Cobble in blocks. I can just leave it right there on the plus sign. Yay. Just lost full netherite armor and tools. Yeah, if I end up doing that in my game, it means I lost my whole world, simply me. I'd trade you. Netherite tools are easy to get back. I'm sure you'll get it figured out. If you have a quarry where you're getting it, you should be good to go. How long have I been doing this world? About 360 hours, Strider. You couldn't find it? I mean, you can find more ancient debris. Or do you mean you can't find ancient debris? Someone said I forgot glass on the sides. Right there. I don't have any glass on me. Glass? I guess it's in here. You can't find that butt bummed about losing it all. You can't find ancient debris? Really? That's weird. So that's the floor. One, two. So it'd be second one down. So like right there. And then we can do that. <clears throat> Ooh. Yes. can't find ancient debris oh where have you looked the best place to go is like y equals 12 in an in another rack waste or in the nether waste and just dig i've found a couple of stacks so far myself i know you're on a server but i'm sure you could find a place the 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 nether is is pretty much never ending jaws toe it's not that rare man i've had enough to deck out my entire set of gear 12 pickaxes for casual disguises no you just go to y12 I, I wouldn't use beds. Beds are messy. You get lava everywhere. You'll die even more. Oh, you can find ancient debris. Oh. Sorry. Yeah, I keep reading can't. Yeah, simply me. I'm sorry. You'll be fine, though. I have faith in you. <laughs> I have faith you'll persevere and make it back out. You'll be twice as strong as you were before. Yeah, that was my bad. Um, what can we put to stop the water? Fence gates? I can do fence gates. I have to go make some fences. We'll test that out here in just a minute. But yeah, fence gates would work. 
Because I don't want to make the water too thin, because if they fall, they might just take fall damage and die. Oh, simply me. Trust me, I get it. Let me double check that none fell through the portal here. Nope, we're good. Okay. Uh, actually, let me, let me just go through the whole process like this again. I don't want to mess anything up. Bye, Ben. Have a good night, dude. Thanks for hanging out. Alright, uh, one second. Let me go here. Nope. Oh, actually, I do want to throw that in there. Throw that in there, put a stack of that in there. We'll keep one on me. And I will turn this into tiles. And we gotta go get some uh, fences. Spruce fences. I got extra wood, so that works for us. Okay. And then up the scaffolding we go. We could do a water elevator now that we've gotten everything established. We'll try we'll try fences. Fence fence gates should work perfectly. I'm I'm building all this from scratch, for anybody wondering. I'm not following any kind of build online. The only thing I am following online is the basic build for the creeper farm, but we're changing it. The way the creeper farm works is it has two chambers with cats that scares them into a hole that goes down water and feeds them into like a kill zone. We're not doing that. We're actually taking them and and we're making four instead of two. We're separating them. They're going to have their own fall chamber into water, but they're going to portal around and come through and fall down to their death at the top. So all this all this other stuff I'm doing is, is completely just me winging it. We might be overbuilding some things. We might be overthinking some things, but I just want to make sure that everything is just solid. Now we need fence gates. I need to come over here and grab. I have sticks, planks. How many can I make with this? Give me fence gates right there. I can make seven. Really? That's all I can make? <laughs> Hold on. Let me put some stuff away. Let me make some room here. I just got a mess everywhere. <laughs> 